The Private Made Public is a series of displays highlighting masterpieces from private collections to celebrate 200 years since Dulwich Pitch Gallery first opened its doors to the public. For our second display, we have a magnificent still life by Antonio de Pereja, generously loaned from Penryn Castle and the National Trust. A contemporary of Diego Velazquez, Antonio de Pereira is perhaps less known today than his counterpart, but in 17th century Madrid, he was the prime painter of still lives. And what we have here is one of the most dramatic examples of his work. We're presented with the leftovers of an extravagant feast. On the table, we see sumptuous plates and ewers. We see a half-eaten pie, a half-eaten loaf of bread, exotic fruits, and pots, utensils, and pans spilling onto the floor. However, there's more to this scene than first meets the eye. This is one of Parada's only paintings to include figures, and there's clearly something going on between the two characters. We see a maid kneeling on the floor who gestures imploringly to a soldier who ignores her and continues to pour himself another glass of wine. Perhaps they are lovers who have quarrelled. Perhaps the soldier has rejected the maid. The painting has also been titled An Allegory of Lost Virtue, and perhaps the maid's lost virtue is symbolised by the broken pot on the floor. The scene may also have a personal significance for Parada, who'd recently stopped his son from marrying a servant, and perhaps this is reflected in the relationship between the two figures and the difference in their social status. Dulwich Pitch Gallery is renowned for its Spanish paintings, especially those by Murillo. However, it's missing a masterpiece of this quality. Here until the 8th of October, the painting provides a dramatic centrepiece to our permanent collection.